Hello Space Cats, I'm Dr Maggie Liu and welcome back to my channel. In solidarity with the Black Lives Matter movement, I wanted to make a video dedicated to highlighting some of the brilliant talent we have in astronomy and space science. Actually, when writing this video, I thought it would be so easy, but when you find out how few PhD holding astronomers are black, you realise how difficult a job it is to compile such a list. But the more reason to do so. So here goes, 10 black role models in astronomy and space. Number one, astronaut Leland Melvin. Astronaut Leland Melvin is probably one of my favorite astronauts, and you might recognize him since he was one of the commentators on the first crewed SpaceX Dragon launch. He's probably most well known, however, for his adorable NASA portrait where he snuck in his two dogs, Jake and Scout. Leland started his career working at NASA testing optical fibers for nine years before he was selected as an astronaut, and he racked up almost 600 hours in space. Number two, Neil deGrasse Tyson. Neil deGrasse Tyson is the current director of the Hayden Planetarium in the American Natural History Museum, where he also founded the Department of Astrophysics. He's probably most well known for the huge amount of public engagement work that he does, and including his cameos in The Simpsons, Family Guy, and The Big Bang Theory, just to name a few. But Tyson is actually a real astrophysicist. He obtained his physics degree from Harvard and a PhD from Princeton, where he worked on the galactic bulge. Number three, Benjamin Banneker. Benjamin Banneker was an 18th century African-American astronomer who published several almanacs to predict eclipses and planetary conjunctions. What's really astonishing about his story was that his father was a slave, but his self-taught astronomy allowed him to calculate accurate predictions of the motions of the sun and the planets. Banneker was an early advocate for abolishing slavery, and one of the almanacs that he published included an essay called On Negro Slavery and the Slave Trade. He sent a copy of this almanac to Thomas Jefferson, who at the time was the US Secretary of State, in a plea for justice and equality for African Americans. Number four, Katherine Johnson. Katherine Johnson, along with Dorothy Vaughan and Mary Jackson, you may know their story from the book and the film adaptation, Hidden Figures. And if you haven't, then I highly recommend that you read and watch it. It made me cry. They were the mathematicians that worked for NASA during the Mercury missions, during which Katherine Johnson calculated the launch window and orbit trajectories for the first human spaceflight. Number five, Maggie Adrian Pocock. Maggie Adrian Pocock is the co-host of the British astronomy TV program, The Sky at Night. But like Tyson, she too is a real space scientist, having obtained a degree in physics and a PhD in mechanical engineering. She then went on to help develop the spectrograph BHROS on the Gemini South Telescope in Chile and worked on instruments for the AOLA satellite whilst working at the Airbus Defence and Space, formerly known as Astrium. Number six, George Carruthers. Speaking of spectrographs, another distinguished African American in the space industry is George Carruthers. Carruthers invented the far UV camera and spectrograph, which was used on board of NASA's Apollo 16 program. Using the invention, he proved that molecular hydrogen exists in space. Number seven, Claudia Alexander. Canadian-born Claudia Alexander was a planetary scientist at NASA's Jet Propulsion Lab, and during that time, she was the project manager for NASA's Galileo mission to Jupiter, which led to its discovery of an atmosphere around its moon, Ganymede. She was science coordinator on the Cassini mission to Saturn and project scientist on Rosetta, the mission that landed on a comet up until her early death.
Number eight, Mae Jemison. NASA astronaut Mae Jemison was the first black woman in space when she flew on the Space Shuttle Endeavour in 1992 after being selected in 1987. Mae has a chemical engineering, African and African studies degree from Stanford and a medical degree from Cornell University. She left NASA in 1993 to start her own technology research company and then went on to become a professor at Dartmouth College in Environmental Studies as well as her many other philanthropic endeavors. Number nine, Ali Petters. Ali Petters is a Belizean American professor of mathematics, physics, and economics at Duke University. He is a pioneer in the mathematics of gravitational lensing, the phenomena where light emitted by distant galaxies is sculpted by the gravity of the intervening mass it encounters. Number 10, John Asher Johnson. John Asher Johnson is a professor of astronomy at the University of Harvard, but not just any professor. He was the first ever tenured African-American physical science professor. His research is on the detection and characterization of exoplanets. And perhaps he is most well known for the discovery of three of the first known planets smaller than the Earth outside of the solar system in 2012. The outermost planet was the smallest known exoplanet at the time. If you're a young black aspiring astronomer, I hope the list can inspire you to pursue a career in astronomy and space. We really do need you. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section below anyone I've missed and what they're most well known for so I can complete this list. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving me a like, share and subscribe.